hello guys this is code and code and this is going to be a course instead of just a single video tutorial on disjoint sets disjoint sets are considered to be uh, one of the advanced data structures uh, disjoint sets have many application in uh, graph theory problems and, and also in discrete mathematics so in this uh, video we are just going to talk about the course overview that what we are gonna achieve through this course and what would be the course structure that we, we would go through so let's have a look at that huh. so this is the course structure first we would, we would talk about the motivation this is one of the most important thing as I can uh, uh, I consider because uh, you must have a clear-cut motivation that why you want to study this data structure or why you want to take this course so if you if you you are going to start some new new thing to learn you must have a motivation why you are going to do this second we will have a look at the introduction of disjoint set data structure that what disjoint set data structures are actually I mean, uh, we would look at uh, specific uh, use cases of them and what are the different uh, difference of op different operations which disjoint data set uh, supports and how they are implemented. Uh, in the third section, we will see what is the implementation, uh, how we implement disjoint data set and then since disjoint data set themselves are not so fast so there are two different techniques which are used to make the runtime better uh, first one is known as union by rank and another is, is path compression so we would have a look at these two techniques uh, in detail and then at last we would uh, we would see how we can implement disjoint set to find or to detect a cycle in graph or find the number of connected components in a graph or find the MST that is minimum spanning tree uh, these are just some of the use cases of disjoint set disjoint set are widely used in many problems uh, in competitive coding and along this course we will also keep solving a competitive coding problem we would take some problems from Core Chef or Hacker Earth and we would solve them uh, uh, as an example so that you could understand the joint set thoroughly. So I hope you guys you, you guys would enjoy this course. Thank you.